Hello everyone and welcome to my video of the Microsoft Curve 3000's keyboard layout. In this video I'll give you a close look at the keyboard's layout. Right, so let's go ahead and get started. Right, let's zoom in on the left side. Right, you have to tap caps lock. The caps lock has a uh, little place that you can place your uh, pinky finger which is a nice. Control, uh, start, alt, everything is very basic. Alright, so this is a curved keyboard and it does have a kind of a hilly um, peak to it and it peaks the highest at about the R or T um, keys. Function keys, numbers, all the letters are about the same um, size and have a little bit of a curve on the spacebar and all the keys. Alright, so on the right side we have the backspace, enter, shift, uh, Alt function control, everything there is pretty much the same on as the left side. Alright, so let's take a look at the delete home end block. We have the delete button, the home end, and then the page up, page down, and the insert screen lock, and the print screen on the top. The arrow keys are right there. Um, it's a little bit too close to the numpad and the right side and the left side, uh, but it's for the most part is still okay. Alright, so on the numpad side, we have the calculator, pause, volume control, and the numpad buttons are pretty much standard. Alright, that concludes my video of the Microsoft 3000's keyboard layout. The included link is my video review and unboxing of the Microsoft uh, Comfort Curve 3000, and feel free to check out my other videos. Thanks for watching, and let me know if you have any questions or comments.